Uh, this, as you can see, is the Palm Trio 500. It's a QWERTY messaging phone. And uh, we've got a nice, um, easy to use QWERTY keyboard there with the nice rounded buttons on there. I'll just try and get a shot of those on the side profile. Very nice. Like little tic tacs they are if uh, anybody knows what they are. Um, here we've got the numeric keys, as you can see, so you can dial using those buttons. If I just start dialing 0, 1, 5, 4, 3, there's a number for cool smartphone. Um, you got little star key and hash key, or pound sign, uh, for the Americans, um, that you can use during a call. You don't have to press shift, but they are kind of hidden off the main numeric keypad there. Uh, so if you call any automated dialer, um, telephone systems uh, where you have to press hash or or star you can use those um, up here is the home key and the back key and the left soft key and the right soft key all backlit there You've got the call answer and the call drop um, one thing I did find on the back there that's a nice camera but getting to it is a little bit tricky if I just show you the only way that I found to get to it and I could be wrong just to go down to pictures and videos and then use camera. There is no dedicated camera button that I can find. Uh, so I can take a photo. Uh, let's just take a photo of this here. I also couldn't find a way of actually turning off the shutter sound. It's quite a loud shutter sound. The only way I could find out of doing it is to actually turn the volume down and mute it. But, um, Anyway, on the right hand side there is absolutely nothing, no camera button or anything like that, don't know quite why. On the top is a little power button, and on the left we've got the volume up and down, and a key which doesn't seem to do anything when you press it once, it just kind of lights up the screen, I presume it's just designed just to do simply that. Let's just lock the, it doesn't really do anything, I'm not quite sure why. Um, Again, this unlock mechanism is a bit, I know it's the Microsoft default, but if you press unlock and then you've got to press star, which is kind of hard to find, it's actually way down there on the Z key, so you've actually got to really get your nail into there. Um, anyway, if you press and hold that key down, it loads Internet Explorer, which obviously won't work because I've got a pay-as-you-go SIM card in with about 10 pence worth of credit on it. Um, on the bottom is a mini USB port, the microphone and a 2.5mm audio cable. And on the back is that camera that we saw earlier along with the rear speaker. That, to be honest, is pretty much it for the Palm 500. So that's a quick uh, overview of the phone and what it does. This is Windows Mobile Smartphone or Windows Mobile Standard, so there is no touch screen on it. Um, you get Google Maps on there. I haven't installed that. Um, you also get Windows Live Messenger on this phone, but whether your network actually includes this is uh, up to them. Uh, internet sharing, um, and that's pretty much it. So it's a fairly standard QWERTY messaging handset. Windows Mobile 6, and that's the Trio 500.